I've drawn all my life and have loved that. It was just a way for me to to pass time. Basically, I'm an only child, so it was uh, it was a natural way to kill time and enjoy myself. So it was always a form of recreation. And uh, I think mom and dad figured out early if they'd buy me paper and crayons, I'd stay in my room and shut up. <laughs> so I was never I never ran out of art supplies. And during the summer times, I'd stay with my grandmother, and after playing outside all day, I'd go three o'clock, turn on PBS, and I'd watch Bob Ross. That was fascinating to watch, especially I was considering, I was young, I was 11 years old, when I really discovered him and kind of got into this. From that point on, I would, I would watch Bob and I'd try to copy what he was doing, you know, I'd paint and try to imitate him with colored pencil or something like that, and then I decided one day, well, I'm going to save up my money and buy one of these kits and try it, so I did. And uh, it literally was just like I, I painted like a crazy person. I was absolutely fascinated with it and I couldn't put it down. I just kept doing it, kept doing it. Took some lessons with a, a teacher in my area and she suggested, you know, you, you really ought to go teach this technique when you're in college, because I was in high school at the time. She said, you ought to teach this technique when you're in college and, uh, you know, make your extra money that way. And that's exactly what I did. All through college, I taught classes on the weekends and finally decided, well, I would rather do this and have a real job, so I started pursuing it full time. And uh, it's, it's, it's been an interesting, uh, it's been an interesting vocation. You know, when I, when I have a class, I'll paint the example that we're gonna do that day, and then I'll, of course, share that to Facebook or Twitter or wherever. And uh, I just, I, I love it because if somebody's interested, they can share it and say, hey, check this out, you know, maybe you wanna do this, because people seem to always have a friend you know that they'd like to introduce to this because I, kn I know I did I love it and that's part of why I love teaching is because I get to I remember what it did for me what learning to paint did for me as far as just mood enhancement and you know general well-being I mean it's just it's a, it's a great activity and it's real life enriching so I think when people experience that they want to share that